I'm Anthony Hudson. What a fine day of sun we have here in Melbourne. A very swirly breeze growing around the ground tonight. Probably not the type of crowd they were expecting. With me today is Gary Lyon. Hey, Hutto, today should be a good match. Today we have the Blues coming up against Collingwood. They're looking sharp, and the crowd are appreciating it. The cheer squad's hard work is paying off. The banners are looking great. It's a big midfield battle today. The Chiba team can get on top in the middle of the ground. We'll walk out winners today. confidence they're looking sharp and the crowd are appreciating it i'm really looking forward to seeing how they play today of course Hannah. the captains prepare for the toss of the corner Collingwood winning the toss. We're just moments away from the opening bounce. The crowd are ready, and we're underway. Downey got the tap. Downey can't hold on to the tackle. Receives the handball and takes off. Intervening brilliantly was Harrington. Drops the mark. Soccer's a kick. Oski off the deck. Harris decides to soccer it. The kick connects with the post. Kiyotsi looking for options now. The mark has been taken. Brazil kicks hard along the boundary line. Puts it on the boot. She finds herself in space and marks. Winning the ball in the air was corner. Decides to kick. Allen flew high but didn't hold on. O'Day was taken high in the tackle. A chance to reload the attack now. Plays on. Strong with the body and wins the mark. Allen elects to kick. An easy grab for Membry. Dug out the loose ball. She gets her hands on the footy. Alexander marks up contested. Spears the ball. It's marked by Allen. Allen kicks it to the square. It's a foot race to get this one. Gathered by Russell. There'll be a ball up in the centre square. What do you make of the game so far, Gary? This is a great game, Hutto, and we can just sit back and enjoy it. Membry hangs on to that one. Putting this one through would give Collingwood plenty of confidence. Gets some reward for her efforts. They draw first blood. That's a really good team goal. She knew that was home as soon as it left the boot. The umpire set the bounce to restart the game. A clean pickup. We'll get a stoppage. Hines oh, slaps it away. The bounce made it tough. Mosky gets the loose ball. Membry goes for territory. Sparkers turns a free kick. Moves the ball by foot.
collects the loose ball, clears the ball from the contest. Stevens wins the marking contest. 25 metres out. A 45 degree angle for this shot at goal. Trying to get some momentum with the kick. She's really enjoying that goal. Carlton take the lead. The game is back underway. Clears the contest. Just dismisses her opponent. G powers through the tackle. Clumsy tackle results in a free kick. Moved on by G. A big contested grab. Chose to kick it. The mark is taken by Powell. Alex to kick. Walker gets in a good position. 40 metres from home. She likes her chances from here. Drop part straight through the middle. That will settle her nerves. Gets her first on the ball. Walker celebrates with the fans. Carlton have kicked back-to-back -back goals. Carlton by seven points. She's got the footy in her hands. Ball ends up with the opposition. Just goes bang. The ball ends up going to ground. Walker gets the handball away. Drop putt finds its way home from Stevens. The teammates rush over. Now they lead by 13. Umpire ready to resume play. Guided down nicely by Downey. Harrington coming on. There'll be a ball up in the centre square. What can you tell us, Gaz? It's a really good contest out there right now, and it's great to watch. Ball up in the centre square. Downey got the tap. Puts boot to ball. The loose ball scooped up. Finds the loose ball. Harris just threw it. Lynch puts it on the boot. Brassel marks it. Well, when you look at the shots at goal, there just hasn't been enough scoring opportunities being created. Get the ball inside 50 and give your forwards a chance to take a mark. Carlton, forwards are dangerous anywhere inside 50. They just need to be given a shot. Dalton turns a free kick. Couldn't quite with the mark. Great attack on the ball carrier. They can create from this. Decides to keep it alive. Lambert with a poor kick out of play. Looks up with a kick. Finds a way to go along the ground. Pretty happy with that one. Collingwood behind by seven. About to resume play. Thump clear. She's got the football now. Slick with the hands. Grant keeping it low. Picking it up was Stevens. Manages to get out the handball. Is in her possession. Jones steps around the tackler. Getting pushed out of the way was Godet. Finding the loose ball was Rizale. Opportunity for Harrington. The ball spills to Livingston. Looks like it's going to be paid deliberate. Uses it by foot. Jones got under it. Goes with the kick. Easily takes the mark. Moves it by foot. Ends up marking uncontested. Looks to move it by foot. Dargan runs after this one. Grant throws the ball away. A piercing kick from Jones. Does well to cut off the kick. The kick from Dargan. Takes it. One quarter down at three to go. Plenty of football still to be played. The scores Carlton 19, Collingwood 12. Carlton came out and started well. They deserved the lead at quarter time. Gary, does anything stand out in the stats? Carlton are getting the ball inside 50 more than the opposition, and at the moment, they're capitalising on the scoreboard. Thank you very much, Gaz.
Ready to go for the second turn. About to resume hostilities. Punches are clear. With the ball now. The handball hits the target. Racking up possessions now. Quick handball. Malloy has resources out wide. Target choosing to play on. Pumps it inside 50. Good mark there. She heads for home. It's a poor kick. And it hits the behind post. Hits the point post. It'll be a free. Moody uses it by foot. Great mark. Jones sends one up towards the wing. Gets around Mr. Invisible. Nice. Livingston goes by hand. O'Day gets a quick kick away. Davy gets the opportunity to have a shot for goal. Slams it on the boot. Doing well with the mark. Hines plays it on. Got boot to ball. Found a way to keep it alive. Benici has an injury. That certainly didn't look great. It looks unlikely she'll see any further action. She loved that one. We're back in motion. Downey thumped it clear. Picks up the loose ball. G getting in on the act. Roberts slams it onto the boot. Jones goes off the ground. Didn't get away from the tackle. Brilliant chase. Hit the man hard. Alexander can link up through hands. Allen moves it by hand, and now they're away. With a driving kick, Rowe with an easy mark. Goes by foot, takes it well. Punches the kick. Good mark and looks to send it back. Uses it now. Ball hits the deck, just gets it onto the boot. Just gave it away. Fowler just threw it. Puts it on the boot. Rushes with the kick. Manages to get a hand away. At full stride, receives the handball. Grant throws the ball away. Rosale has resources out wide. Sinks the slipper into it. Mark by Harris. With a driving kick. Takes the mark. A low stabbing kick. Finds this and marks well. Moves it by foot. Gibbs leaps over the top. She spears the ball. Stuck the mitts out there and held on to it. Goal scoring opportunity for Pound. Going for goal number one. The drop punt goes straight between the big sticks. She celebrates hard after that. Seven points the difference. Back with another set of bounce. Harris got a fist to it. Allen just gets it out of the booth. Nice work from Jones. Jones has resources out wide. Edwards has it. Handballs. Ends up with Rosale. She just throws that ball. Allen drives a low kick. Membry did well to win that ball. A spearing kick. Gets into a good position to take that. Carlton haven't been able to set up any set shots at goal, but I'm not sure that it's the forward's fault. The ball has been coming in way too slow. You can't expect your forward to kick a winning total that way. Membry will be the recipient of the free. Moves the ball by foot. Scoops it up. And now Lambert needs a bit of a rest. Up for grabs for McAvoy. Looks like the ball will be coming back. Now with a low spearing kick. Darcy couldn't hang on to the ball. Gathers it now. Mops up the loose ball. Just put it on the boot. Hacking it out of there. Seen plenty of it. Fantastic tackle. Just threw the ball. Keeps the kick low. A mark by Lloyds. Looks up with the kick. Walker didn't mark it. Sockers it forward. 
Clean pick up by Harris. Gets a quick kick away. Finds this one all by herself. Intercepted. Stevens won herself a free. She decides to go for home. That one hits the woodwork. Carlton by eight points. Considering the options on the kick in, Giotti decides to go herself. Works it from the back half. Hines used the body to take that mark. Carlton just aren't running for each other or creating space to work into. And as a result, they haven't been able to earn many set shots inside 50. Strong mark in the context. What a brilliant tackle! A great defensive effort. Well, it's half-time, Gaz. What are your thoughts at the major break? It's been a promising first half for Carlton. They'd be confident they can keep it going in the second half. Gary, does anything stand out in the stats? Carlton have allowed the opposition more of the ball, but aren't allowing them to score from those positions. They are defensively very sound. Thanks, Gary. Well, I hope you enjoyed that first half. Back soon with a second half action. We're set to go at the start of the third quarter. Downey with the hit has it now. Gained some territory. The loose ball picked up. Quickly onto the boot. Walker grabs that one. Looks to move it by foot. Open opportunity for Gibbs. 45 metres out. Going for goal number one. That was sweet. They put through another. Gibbs wouldn't be happier with that goal. Carlton starting to exert some dominance now. They lead 32 to 18. O'Day rushes with the kick. And we'll get a ball up. Can you tell us anything at the moment, Gaz? I'm liking what I'm seeing at the moment, Hutto. A great game of football. Taken by Roberts, linking by hand. The tackle deserves a free and gets it. Fantastic pressure there. Ends up turning this ball over. Carlton just aren't running for each other or creating space to work into. And as a result, they haven't been able to earn many set shots inside 50. Pound has resources out wide, takes the mark all by herself. Giotti elects to kick. Livingston got under it. Puts boot to ball. And the mark will be paid. Punches the kick. Sasha has a great set of hands. Goes with the kick. Coughed up by Dalton. Livingston. There to mop up. Using every ounce of energy she has left. Takes a simple grab. 45 metres out, lining up from a 45 degree angle. Bessier going for number one. Offline for a behind. Carlton by 15 points. Carlton could cost themselves with turnover today. They need to find a way to control the play better and stop turning it over. Slicer tucks it into the pocket. Bessier takes it well. 20 metres from home. She drives it towards goal. She's excited about that one. The lead is now 21. We resume hostilities. Hammers it. Difficult ball control. Harrington hacks it out of there. Bessier with the mark. 25 metres out, almost directly in front here. Move it on. Looking to kick goal number two. Bessier enjoying that goal. Carlton, 45, play Collingwood, 18. Clears the contest. Membry finds possession. Just got the hands in the back there. Doing well to intercept that kick. Hurry kick. A race for the loose ball. Dug out by Slicer. Scoops up the ball. Sock is a kick. 
Lambert a bit too casual with the tackle. Vessia was taken high in the tackle. She likes her chances from here. She acknowledges the crowd. Carlton doing well at the moment. She did really well there and gets the reward. This is how they can score big, Hutto. If they can do that on a consistent basis, it's massive. We resume hostilities. Moody with a big fist on it. Moody doesn't get low enough and gives away the free. Drops the ball. Brazil thinks to live. Yeah, she's having a quiet match, Hutto. Marks now and can send it back. Chiotti drives the kick. He intercepts the ball well. Uses it now. Gibbs marks it. Didn't have time to break stride to mark that. Controlled well off the bounce. Uses it by foot. Takes an uncontested mark. A low stabbing kick. Off hands from Van Dyke. Rowe giving away the free kick. Elects to kick. Terrific mark there. Carlton have the lead, but they're allowing plenty of opposition marks inside 50. They need to fix up that aspect of the game if they're to stay on top. Lambert goes with the kick. Takes that one strongly. The kick goes out on the full from Chris Marcus. Converting these opportunities could make a big difference to today's result. Big kick required from this distance. Lambert needs to deliver a goal with this chance. Never on target and a behind. Margin in a really tricky situation. Lambert does well to mark. Bit of an angle for this kick. Good body work to win the mark. Carlton are allowing too many marks inside the opposition forward 50. If they continue to get beaten in this area, they'll find it difficult to keep the lead. Van Dyke moves it now. Does well to cut off the kick. Normally a pretty good kick. Let's see what she can do here. Might be too far out to score. Fowler going for number one. No issues with that drop punt. Collingwood badly needed that one. Congratulated by her teammates. Margin in a really tricky situation. A great bit of play that resulted in that goal. That came off the back of some good work further up the ground. Not long left on the clock now. Back in the middle as the rucks go at it. Moody hurls it away. Walker gets on the end of this. Uses the bump. Great tackle. Unable to create the space. Great. Gaz, what are your thoughts after that third quarter? Carlton walk into three-quarter time with the lead and the confidence they can win this game. Let's see what the stats have to show. Collingwood are doing well to control the ball in the air. They are getting to the right spots to cut off opposition attacks. They just need to be more controlled from this point forward. Thank you. Last quarter action, ready to go. Oh, they're going to take some risks now. They can't afford to waste any time. Downey keeps it moving. O'Day gets in the way. Kicks hurriedly. Great mark under pressure. Dargan has resources out wide. Ran hard to take that mark. Goes by foot. Lambert over the top. 
This is kickable by her standards. Normally a good shot on goal. Going for goal number one. Almost delivers, but not quite. Collingwood now only trailed by 25. Moody plays onto herself. Kicks it out of defence. Doing well to intercept that kick. Carlton haven't been able to set up many set shots at goal, but I'm not sure that it's the forward's fault. The ball has been coming in way too slow. You can't expect your forward to kick a winning total that way. The kick goes out on the fall from Allen. Sinks the slipper into it. Slams it onto the boot. Picked off the deck. Releases the handball. Applies a bump. Alexander takes it well. Lloyds will be the recipient of the free. Slams it on the boot. McAvoy found some space and marked. Dargan got hands to him. Dug it out. That's holding the ball. Constricted by Davy. Constant pressure and rewarded. Carlton have the lead, but they're allowing plenty of opposition marks inside 50. They need to fix up that aspect of their game if they're to stay on top. They can just slow the game down now, take a bit of time off the clock. She gives chase to the footy, clear free, just put both hands in the back. Well, when you look at the shots at goal, there just hasn't been enough scoring opportunities being created. Get the ball inside 50 and give your forwards a chance to take a mark. Carlton, forwards are dangerous anywhere inside 50. They just need to be given a shot. Doesn't hold on to the mark. It has to be a big kick to get it from there. Lining up on a bit of an angle here is Lambert. She heads for home. Hooks the kick. Collingwood reduced the margin. Carlton could turn the ball over a lot trying to play aggressively. It's where they turn it over which doesn't make it as dangerous. Sheridan going for number one. She's excited about that one. That's two in a row for Collingwood. Margin within touching distance. Allen cuts it off. Hines wants to keep it moving by hand. Davey controlling the airwaves on this occasion. Handballs. Did well to keep it in. Dargan has a chance to put a second goal on the ball. Dargan puts it out on the full. Bernici looks to convert this opportunity. 35 metres out. Going to need a good kick to put it through here. She decides to go for home. Can't take the mark. Collingwood behind by 17. The Blues have actually turned it over more than the opposition, but they haven't allowed that to translate into scores. It's why they're still in front. The ball goes out of bounds on the full. Lining up for goal. 40 metres out. Deep in the pocket. It's going to take a good kick from here. Good call, Hutto. She drives it towards goal. Collingwood, the margin, back within three goals. Stevens lays on. Puts it on the boot. Stands tall and marks. Hosking kicks it. Takes a nice mark. Manufactures a handball. Gives the old don't argue. She gets her hands on the footy. What can you tell us at this stage, Gary? This is a great game, Hutto, and we can just sit back and enjoy it. Ball gets cut off. Wins the race to the ball. Thump clear. Benici off the deck. The ball spills. She's got the footy in her hands. Receives the handball and takes off. Looks like the ball will be coming back. Kick by Giotti. And she stepped over the boundary line. Membry heads onto the ground. Toss back into play. Punches it clear. A clean collect. Use the hands and gives away the free. Hosking puts it on the boot. 
The ball goes over the line. It'll be a throw in. Ball back into play. Big thump from Venici. Oh, Dave! Gets the ball. The ball finds Jared. 15 metres out. No luck for him there. And it's a behind. Collingwood close the gap to 15. Stevens searching for a teammate. Kicks it out of the back half. Taking a nice grab. 40 metres out. Going for goal number two. She bangs it through. Look at her. She really enjoyed that one. Collingwood have kicked the last three goals. It's under two goals now. They're looking more dangerous inside 50 now. Great reward for effort. About to resume hostilities. Hine oh, thumps it forward. Hosking collected the ball well. Releases the handball. Harris gets a quick kick away. Got boot to ball. Coughed up by Brazel. She can put it through. What a sensational goal. Celebrating hard. Carlton by 15 points. It's great to watch, Hato. Plenty of excitement. Some great ball movement there. You just knew they were going to score. Back in the middle now. Hines oh, clears the contest. Almost cut it off. Malloy picks it up. Off hands. Lambert gathers it now. Use the hands and gives away the free. Takes a few deep breaths before this important kick. Carlton is certainly deserving of that win. I thought we saw one side capitalise on their chances and the other didn't. And so often we see that determine the result. Final scores are 9 3 57 to 6 6 42. Thanks for joining us. As always, it's been a pleasure. We look forward to seeing you back soon. It was great being here, Hutto. I can't wait for the next match.